Octogon. That's where it all is. Octogon. Lizards in Switzerland and Basel train station. There's another one. Switzerland, the home of the uh, lizards, apparently. There's the uh, Isis, two times. And there is uh, Switzerland, the Templar's Cross. So this is the uh, train station in Basel. And here, well, I don't see it here. The Templar's symbol. The V for victory, well it says victory. Still at the Basel train station. So here's the Bank of International Settlements. You can't film in front of it because uh, uh, police will come immediately. So that's Hitler's bank in Basel. So here's the railway station. With this bank, so they got the, um, it was founded just a few months after Black Tuesday in October 1929 and the American Depression started so they stole all the money of all these honest American citizens and they got it here in Switzerland to finance the uh, the Nazi war industry with the stolen money of the American people with it this is how they did it and then they dare to say we respect all men or I don't know what they say here clean Switzerland you know yeah they honor all people like men, it says. That's horrible. I don't know what this is. I'll look at it later. That's Hilton. Next to the biz, eh? The dragon ship. And it says... Fluctuat nec mergitur in Basel. So here's the other part of the biz. I'm not going to get any nearer because uh, they uh, erase your card and you know the film and uh, call up the cops and all that. So this is called uh, the Bahnhof, the train station, this is that side. On this side here, the place where you can see it here, it's called Eichengraben on the place is called the place Eichenplatz which means the place of um, ashes well it's called the place of ashes because actually um, they burned the uh, uh, in the middle ages they burned a lot of women here so the ashes the place of the ashes and therefore it's no coincidence that every Swiss bank as we can see here and uh, insurance company it's being represented here as an omen of, of uh, you know who's really ruling here so or sort of black magic taking the energy of all those tortured and burned women and up here there's a a prison which is called Wachhof and that means to weigh on a scale so we know the witches they were weighed and if they were too light then uh, they got burned so they tortured them up here which where, where there's a prison now and then they burned them here and they're still very proud of it everything is called here with ashes this is where they burned the women and the burning of women and torturing of the inquisition it was in fact the swiss inquisition it was a swiss idea because from this place here basel Baal, where the devil lives uh, there were two Swiss guys, Heinrich Kramer and Jakob Spenger, who uh, wrote a book which is called The Witch's Hammer, uh, the Maleus Maleficarum. So this is why they did it, and they still know it. They still know it. So here's the biz, the Bank of International Settlements. This is the second part of it. Um, they built it later, so I'm not going to get any nearer. It's full of cameras, as we can see here, everywhere. Yeah, they're probably looking already. And uh, so the place of the ashes. Very bad. Look. Wham! Smashed the uh, European women. 
In Basel, this is one of the animals in the revelations that John saw, sort of a leopard here. There it is. Another church here in Basel. With a knight killing the dragon or whatever he does. And it looks like some sort of a Viking door. Here in Basel, the same church. Here are some more dragons here. There are some more dragon stuff. So here's Bars, Basel or Baal, as in Baalbek, and it's quite an evil place. So here's the same church again here. So on the way we bought this here, showing the pharaonic car, meaning the soul when alive and also the intrinsic life energy as the Japanese key which is definitely the pharaonic car because all civilization, science and progress is from them but we had to sell our souls or car to them for it all the Chinese call this life energy car or key the qi and in fact ginger as in this ginger ale is very good for the qi the life energy or the car as it shows here ginger is very warming and makes the qi abundant it also says on the can that this ginger beer is from Jamaica, a place where our souls can live. See the Pharaoh show in the Octagon series for further explanation. And any descendant of the enemy within and true Pharaoh still living amongst us knows that the mere aspect of the image of Ka with a palm tree is a reminder of the River Nile's nostalgia. A Swiss door. Mm. And some more Swiss reptilians in Bal. I told you, uh, they are so cold and calculating so there's a hotel in Baal where the, it's the three kings which is the number three and it's Isis, Horus and Seth and up there are four obelisks uh, giving the number four so three and four together make seven which is very important for the pharaohs I'll give a closer picture later on and uh, yeah so that's also the three sides of the pyramid number three and then the underside and the four elements number four earth water fire and air and uh, here came a lot of kings and still you know the uh, new world order so from here we can perfectly see that's an obelisk and that's a swimming pool on top so the four obelisk giving the uh, number four the underside of the pyramid and the number three the side here in Basel in Octagon, the Empire of Darkness, Switzerland. So even Napoleon came here apparently. Yeah. And Henry Kissinger's and kings and queens all come here. Oh, there's the Three Kings Hotel from this side here. Yeah. A lot of fancy cars here. Oh, I'm a very important person. Oh, yeah. In Basel. Uh, sun hieroglyph all over. There it is. And another one with the uh, sun hieroglyph with the Freemasonry triangle. 
A lot of gold, I like gold. Reptilians. Some more reptilians. It's full of it here. In Baal, where the devil lives. Pyramids in Octagon. Pyramid in Octagon. Swiss pharaohs. Just a pyramid in the backyard. Well, what is this? The pyramid in Octagon. Oh, the Swiss pharaohs, they like this. Look at this. Oh, what is this here? What is this doing in Switzerland? Pyramid in Octagon. Tell you the Swiss like pyramids in Octagon. They're just so attracted to it. Now what are all these pyramids doing in somebody's backyard here in Switzerland? I mean, the pharaohs are here, I tell you, they are here. This is Octagon, Switzerland. I watch the pharaohs, don't you understand? Look at it. They're here, right? They are here. Now go and have a pyramid in your backyard. In Octagon. Lots of pyramids with the Swiss pharaohs in Octagon. Oh, they like these sort of things. An octagon. Loads of pyramids in octagon. How come they're standing here in Switzerland? Well, watch the pharaoh shine, you know it. So this is the criminal state of Switzerland where they're hiding the gold and the stash the money in the mountains here. This is Octagon. 
I mean, where do the Swiss come from? The Swiss Germans are not at all like Germans. They don't even like each other. The French-speaking Swiss, les Romans, are not at all like the French. The Italian-speaking Swiss in Tessin, they are not like the Italians. So where do they come from? These people who brought so much harm and suffering to the Europeans. And they definitely are not European. They show this in their history and they show this today. So the question may be put here, where do they come from? Okay? Then definitely not from here. You know, you could never have French, Germans and Italians having them live together. You know, they would they would have a world war, you know, we had world wars, you know, never. So the Swiss are not French, Germans and Italians living together. They are one people or one entity speaking three or four languages, you know, in order to do their wrongdoings all over in Europe. That's what they are. They are not Italians and they're not Germans and they're not French. Never. Think about this.